Well now, the museum dedicated to one of Hollywood's biggest ever stars, it's the Laurel and Hardy Museum in Ulverston, which was Stan Laurel's hometown. They're looking forward to renewed interest in the most popular of comedy duos. Looking forward to it because a new movie about Stan Laurel and Oliver Hardy is opening in cinema soon with Steve Coogan playing Stan. We sent Paul Crone to Ulverston to investigate, we hope, without ending up in another fine mess. <laughs> she ain't never regret re -ends. And you shouldn't regret Rianne either. Middleton-born Steve Coogan's uncanny resemblance to comedy genius Stan Laurel. Stan and Ollie tells the story of Laurel and Hardy's tour of the UK after World War II. And the film about the comedy duo has brought a big smile to the face of the curator of the Laurel and Hardy Museum in Ulverston, the birthplace of Stan Laurel. As the snippets of information have been released, I've just got more and more and more excited and then when the trailer came out, it is wonderful. We are so excited about it. Visitors from all over the world come to the museum. Today, a family from Switzerland showed us how Stan and Ollie make us laugh, irrespective of age or generation. A picture paints a thousand words. <laughs> Stan was better than anyone could, would ever imagine. The, the world thought of him as the guy on the screen, um, but behind the scenes he was involved in the editing, the writing, the directing, every single thing that happened on screen was there because Stan gave it the okay and it was there because it needed to be there. Laurel and Hardy did visit Ulverston in May 1947 and received a rapturous reception outside the town's Coronation Hall, as this rare footage shows. Stan Laurel was always very proud of his Ulverston roots and would frequently chat to Ollie about what a great place it was. He was such a modest man that up until the day he died, you could still find his name, address and phone number in the local directory. You're not leaving, are you, Stan? The show must go on. <laughs> Stan and Ollie opens in cinemas in the new year, and Ulverston can be duly proud of its most famous son, Paul Crone, ITV News. Great old pictures. Yeah, amazing. Cannot wait to see the film too.